Hi everybody, welcome back to our channel. For dinner tonight, we ordered something new. Take home sushi stand. Easier to say, take home sushi stand. And we ordered a 40 piece TKHM. 40 pieces roll, which is salmon cream cheese bonito. And two orders, eight pieces of their migori, which is torch salmon, cucumber, and mayo. So let's check it out. So this is their signature TKHM roll. Salmon, cream cheese, and bonito. For 575 pesos on grab. This is their migori. Torch salmon, cucumber, and mayo for a hundred eighteen pesos each on gram. Comes with calamansi, soy sauce, and that is their wasabi. So for the TKHM roll, I was expecting raw salmon, but it's cooked. I can't believe it. That's pretty disappointing. So all ingredients there, but I was expecting raw salmon. That is cooked salmon. Dipping in a little bit of soy sauce and wasabi. Okay, first bite. It's mushy rice. Right? Definitely not sushi rice. Hardly any salmon to begin with. Up next, the migori, which is torched salmon. Cucumber and mayo. What's interesting is this salmon even looks more raw than the other salmon. But anyway, that is torch salmon, it's supposed to be. Okay, got some seaweed, cucumber, mayo. I have to say though, the mayo is not Japanese mayo, it's local mayo. I don't think I've tried sushi this bad in such a long time. I probably wouldn't recommend ordering any of the other items, but in terms of the sushi that was prepared for us tonight, this is super horrible just because the rice, the combination of ingredients, the salmon was cooked on this roll, which is horrible. I actually like the Midori better, but overall, Super disappointing. This sushi story even got worse. Not every piece of their signature roll even has salmon. This is crazy. How is it possible? What happened to quality control? Anyway, guys, I will never order again. Uh, please stay safe and we'll see you in the next episode. We would never order this again. <laughs> I gave a piece to our fluffly and she didn't even finish it and she loves salmon. I can't believe it. It's not good enough even for a cat. Guys, this is my final review for Grab. This is the worst sushi experience I've ever had in my life. I don't normally post a review but I felt a moral obligation to do so. I ordered 40 pieces TKHM sushi. There was zero salmon in most pieces, instead filled with a sweet mayo, not even Japanese, and in others, a dark questionable protein, which just makes me want to puke even thinking about it. I mean, look at this. What the hell is that? The sushi rice was mushy with a disgusting mouthfeel. Even my cat was traumatized by the experience. When I offered her a piece, she just ran away when she loves salmon. I've complained to Grab and I've requested a full refund to remove this restaurant from Grab to prevent others from having further disappointment and suffering. I'll be posting this horrendous experience on my YouTube channel. So I already gave them two thumbs down. Depressing. And you know what? It won't let me submit it. But you didn't say the bad word. Why? It says my language is not appropriate. Anyway, you guys know me. This is my honest review. And that's it. 
don't order from this place. Thanks for watching. Please stay safe. And we'll see you in the next episode. Grab responded quickly within 24 hours and I was able to receive a partial refund. So thanks to their customer service. And guys, please take care.